Mining law is the branch of law relating to the legal requirements affecting minerals and mining. Mining law covers several basic topics, including the ownership of the mineral resource and who can work them. Mining is also affected by various regulations regarding the health and safety of miners, as well as the environmental impact of mining. Topics Topic. Ownership An aspect of property law that is central to mining law is the question of who «owns» the mineral, such that they may legally extract it from the earth. This is often dependent on the type of mineral in question, the mining history of the jurisdiction, as well as the general background legal tradition and its treatment of property. For instance, in many jurisdictions, rights to mine gold and silver are retained by the sovereign, as the two metals traditionally served as currency in many a given society. Topic. Support In addition to ownership of the mineral, the method of extraction may affect nearby property owners. Subsidence be it dramatic or subtle, results when a mine or similar area collapses or drops, causing above or nearby structures to drop with it, often damaging or destroying them. The issue of support rights determines the legal rights and relationships between parties in these situations. By country Mining law varies both by the legal tradition of the jurisdiction, as well as the individual jurisdiction. Mining law in German-speaking countries Mining law in Europe originated from medieval common law. From at least the 12th century, German kings claimed mining rights to silver and other metals, taking precedence over the local lords. But by the late Middle Ages, mining rights, known as the Burgregel were transferred from the king to territorial rulers. Initially, mining rights were granted orally or in writing by individuals. From the early 15th century, mining law was enacted by territorial rulers in the form of decrees or regulations mining regulations or Burgorningen, which often remained in force until the 19th century. A new, far-reaching, legal basis was created with the General Mining Act for the Prussian States of 1865 für die von 1865, which, with local variations, was adopted in Brunswick 1867, Bavaria 1869, Württemberg 1874, Baden 1890, and other countries. With the exception of the Kingdom of Saxony, where a similarly important legal statute, the General Mining Act of the Kingdom of Saxony came into force on 16 June 1868, it became law in all the larger states of Germany. Today In Germany, under Article 74 number 11 of the Basic Law Basic Law, mining law is subject to concurrent legislation. The central legal standard is the Federal Mining Act In Austria the legal basis is quite similar to German law. The primary legislation since 1 January 1999 has been the Mineral Raw Material Act or Minrog. In Switzerland mining law is a cantonal business and governed by cantonal law. Mining law in Liechtenstein is restricted to just a few minerals metallic ores, fossil fuels and related materials like graphite, anthracite, stone coal, lignite, slate coal, asphalt, bitumen and mineral oils, sulfur, rock salt and salt springs and governed mainly by the Liechtenstein Property Act, Articles 484-497. As in Switzerland mining in Liechtenstein is no longer important and the regulations in the Property Act are largely only procedural regulations. <laughs> mining law in English-speaking countries Unlike German mining law, in Great Britain and the Commonwealth the principle of mining by landowners prevails. The Crown only lays claim to gold and silver reserves. In exceptional cases e.g. where land ownership is divided mining rights may be given to a third party, whereby the landowners have to be compensated. 
The mining company pays the landowner a lease, dead rent or a royalty. The rights to above and below ground minerals as a rule quarries and mines may be awarded separately. Mining law in the United States is also based on English common law. Here the landowner is likewise the owner of all raw materials to unlimited depth. However, the state retains rights over phosphate, nitrate, potassium salts, asphalt, coal, oil shale and sulfur, and a right of appropriation not ownership by the state for oil and gas. Sand and gravel come under the Department of the Interior. <laughs> Mining law in French-speaking countries In France and Belgium the Code Civil is the basis for mining law. See also Bergamt, German Mining Office Bergrigel, Medieval Mining Rights and Royalties Burgorning, German Mining Regulations Law on Mining Concessions, Chile Mining Act General Mining Act of 1872 United States Minerals and Mining Law of 1986 Ghana.